Hello everyone, welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. And this time we'll be doing... Ah, Trunks, the Warrior of Hope. Yes, that. Yes, goodbye, 20th World Tournament. And hello, Trunks, the Warrior of Hope. Jumping right into it. Ah, this is the future. Goku has died. He had stood tall against the deadliest of foes. But the mighty warrior was no match for the virus in his heart. Did I see Piccolo? Was he still alive? Though those close to Goku were overcome with sadness, they continued to lead peaceful lives for some time. But six months later, two monstrosities appeared on an island to the south. Earth's defenders met them head on, but they stood no chance. Piccolo was the first to fall. Then Vegeta, Yamcha, Tien, and Krillin all lost their lives. The two androids plunged the world into a state of constant fear and chaos. It is here, 13 years later, that our story begins. A story about a world without Goku. Vegeta and Bulma's son, Trunks, has grown into a young man with a strong sense of justice. How could the androids do this? How could they be so cruel? <clears throat> Gohan is the only warrior left alive to face off against the android threat. Trunks, admiring Gohan's strength and burning with a desire to defeat the androids, makes an impassioned plea. Gohan, I want to be stronger. I want to put a stop to these monsters. Please, train me so I can help you fight. Hello, Gohan people, and I'll welcome to the stream. The last surviving warrior. Trunks. Okay, I'll do it. Thank you, Gohan. You won't regret this, I promise. My day is good. Several days later, Trunks begins his intense training with Gohan, hoping to improve his skills enough to contend with the androids. All right, let's get started with today's training. Right! I can't wait! I know I don't really have to say this, but I will anyway. The androids are insanely strong. I'm gonna fight you as if I'm fighting them. If you don't do the same, you're gonna get hurt. Understood. Here I come! Okay, so on the topic of voices, um... I'm going to become strong enough to beat you, and then beat the androids! I've seen the newest, the uh, trailer on Spocking Zero. With GT, and all I have to say is I hate Goku's voice as a shrunken kid. I miss the original. As a watcher of GT, yeah, not a fan of the new voice. Okay, this button scheme's different. Mm, does not have a blast on him. Man, I'm rusty. Try this 
Quick learner, Trunks. I'm impressed. Still got a lot more in me. This time! <laughs> That attack was pretty solid. Wow, Trunks. Seeing you fight like this reminds me a lot of Vegeta. Your droids are a lot stronger than this. It means a lot to me, Gohan. Like, I can just see myself modding Sparking Zero now just to fix one, Teen Gohan's voice, which is horrendous, and two, Goku GT's voice, which I also don't like. Other watchers of GT may agree with me on that. I miss the original voice. Okay. I do. Oh my god, the people watching this on, on YouTube when it becomes out of recording would be so confused. You're good, Trunks. You're definitely Vegeta's son. I'm still not good enough. I don't think Thanks I'll for the ever sub, man. be able to beat you at your best. <laughs> No way. You're going to be even stronger than me someday. I'm counting on it. I sure hope so. All right. We better head back. Bulma's not going to be too happy if we stay out here any longer. Right. Definitely can't let her know I'm training with you. I'll go with you part of the way. Thanks. What is this? You're telling me things I already know. Why does it... Oh, okay, cool. What? Why does it always act like you're new to the game every time you play a DLC? <laughs> okay. <laughs> every single time. Stop it. No. Uh, I have to equip this myself, more than likely. Because I didn't start with a blast. Yep. I have to equip it myself. Blast. And we'll put the other one over here. If we don't hurry, my mother's going to start worrying about me. Given the way things are now, I wouldn't blame her. By the way, how's she doing? Good. Well, pretty good. She's kind of run into some trouble with something she's working oh, on. Oh, man. Hey, wait, that's... Didn't know I was going to start that soon. Huh? Trunks, wait! <laughs> Somebody help! Go on. That guy over there's in trouble. Right. I'm on it. Are you okay? Who, who are you two? You were attacked by that thing, weren't you? Oh no! Huh? What is this? The, that alarm. It's going to get the android's attention. What? This is the turn of events. <laughs> you hear that, AT? Yeah, I hear it. Sounds like fun to me. Oh, is this a hiding game now? We're doomed! Doomed! The androids are no doubt on their way now! Trunks, quickly, take this person somewhere safe. I'll do my best to distract the androids if they show up. Right, will do! I don't think so. I don't think it's on mobile. I sure hope Trunks was able to find a safe hiding spot. <laughs> Oh, it's only you. I was hoping for a change of pace, but I guess that's not gonna happen. This sucks. We're just repeating the same fight over and over again. It's the androids. So what that guy was saying was true. They actually showed up. What are you doing here, Trunks? Uh, I thought I could help you fight them. No, you're not strong enough yet to take them on. You're not even a Super Saiyan hey, man. He's already showed up for the party. So why not let him join in on the fun, huh? I guess it's too late now. Try to avoid them and stay right behind me as much as you can. Right. Got it. Meet any better conditions. Better ones. Send the opponent one time. Reduce the Andrew's HP by a combined total of 40%. Oh, that's, that's, that's new. You too, man. Here I go. But ah! assault battles. Okay, this is different. The one trunks are not yet strong enough to face the unbelievably powerful androids, so they would need to find an oppor opportune moment to escape. Okay. Don't try to win. Just focus on staying alive. Damn it. 
He's gonna try to give us a chance to get out of here. Okay. Looks like they're running out of steam. What are you two talking about? Okay, okay, so you can fight, kinda. Get out! Because all of my crew members have a backstory, including me. That's what I got, okay. Time to cheese! That was too easy. Oh, I thought it was gonna be hard. This is our only shot at getting away. Trunks, now's our chance to get out of here. Right. Well, oh, damn. Looks like they got away. Whatever. They weren't that fun anyway. Let's get out of here. Sure. Maybe they'll actually put up a fight next time. But I'm not holding my breath. Okay, I think they're gone now. Yeah, looks like it. I sure hope that guy we helped out earlier is okay. Yeah, I'm worried about him too. You mind showing me where he is? Sure, I'll take you there. Sir, are you okay? Oh, it's you two, so you're still alive. Yeah, you look like you're doing okay too. You know, when that thing found me, I thought I was a god. He kind of looks like a different version of you Professor Oak. To the rescue. Thank you so much. Ah, oh, it was nothing. By the way, what exactly was that drone? That was one of the Red Ribbon Army's old patrol bots. Dangerous little guys. What? It's programmed to fly around Red Ribbon Army facilities, and if it detects any potential intruders, it sounds an alarm to call reinforcements. Okay, but there aren't any Red Ribbon Army facilities in this area, though. That's true, but it appears the bot is operating on its own. It's forgotten its patrol routine, and instead detects threats anywhere, all around the world. To make matters worse, the androids are the ones around to hear and respond to its alarm. If you don't intend to fight the androids, you only have two options. Either evade the drone or destroy it. If the alarm does trigger, you should be able to avoid alerting the androids by destroying the drone right away. I see. Thanks for the information. That's a little different. You really do seem to know a lot about drones and stuff. Indeed. That's because I'm a researcher who specializes in mechanical engineering. Anyway, the Red Ribbon Army robots make use of some experimental technology. Their state-of-the-art command drones control other drones, and inside those command drones are some particularly rare parts. I thought I'd try to procure one of those rare parts and finally do something about those drones. But then one of them spotted me. Are you serious? That's dangerous. He's right. You should stay far away from that drone. Huh, maybe you're right. But if you two could destroy that command drone for me and help procure that part, it'd really help me out. Think it's possible? I'll reward you for your efforts, of course. Huh. If that thing's still around to alert the androids, it could end up getting a lot more people killed. So, you'll help me, will you? I suppose. At least as much as I can. Oh, that's perfectly fine with me. I'll be counting on you two, so stay safe. 
So we're after a drone that can alert the androids. We definitely have to stop it. Right. But if we don't handle this carefully, we'll end up fighting the androids when we don't need to. We have to be smart. You can say that again. I mean, as much as I hate to admit it, I'm no match for the androids right now. Okay. Let's try to make our way back as safely as we can. Right. Now it's a stealth mission. Android assault. Drones are now patrolling areas. For drone spots, you and its alert meter feels completely. It will sound an alarm and draw the androids to the area. Hmm. Oh. Multiple drone types. Drones have different functions. Red stays in place and surveys a set radius around its location. Yellow pursues the player if they are spotted. Purple. Commander drone that manages other drones. Oh, so I destroyed a commander, the rest fall, huh? Hmm. I'm going to give you, give you parts when destroyed, which can be exchanged for items from the researcher. Hmm. Ah, levels three. Oh, man. That is crazy. Have to make sure the drone doesn't spot me. All you gotta do is stay low, low to the ground. I got stuff for entering a building. Oh, made it. I bet you're pretty tired. Get plenty of rest. You'll need it for our training tomorrow. Right. Thanks for today, Gohan. See you tomorrow. The next day. Okay, Mom. I'm gonna meet Gohan now. See you later. You've been hanging out with Gohan a lot recently, Trunks. You better not be putting yourself in danger. Are you putting yourself in danger? Uh, of course not. <laughs> Is that so? Okay, then. As long as you're going to see him, why not ask Gohan to join us for dinner? We've got more than enough food. That's a great idea, Mom. Gohan will love that. I'll ask him. Okay, bye. Be careful out there. Pretty sure in the abridged, she tries to woo Gohan. Pretty sure. Yep. All right, time to go meet Gohan. I wonder what today's training is going to be. What's the yellow stuff? Got a training area. Dinner with Gohan. We'll be able to talk about all sorts of stuff. It's going to be great. They might be out of my league. I just hope Mom hasn't figured out that me and Gohan are training together. What is that? I want to know what that is, but I'm being chased. They might be out of my league. Well, if they go away... Damn it! Where's that one coming from? They might be out of my league. Boink. Ah, uh, shit. Okay. Take that! What is this? I have to return to... Oh. No. I fought them for that. Sorry for the wait, Gohan. You get enough rest yesterday? If not, you're not gonna get as much out of this training as you should. I'm good. All right. I'm sure you know firsthand how strong the androids are. And that's why we need you to become a Super Saiyan as soon as possible. Okay. Let's get right into it. It's gonna be tough, 
But once you're warmed up, I'll help you out. So, you ready? Yep, let's do this. More battle? More battle. Okay, here I come. Sure, bring it on. You're getting there. No, I can keep going. Here it comes. Take that. That was a pretty good attack. But it's not going to help you become a super saiyan. Get angry, Trunks. Come on. Okay. Pretend I'm an android. Let the rage consume you. You as an android? Well, that's gonna be tough, but I'll try. Enough for now. I just swore he was in blue. How did, how did he lose his health so fast? It sure is hard to become a Super Saiyan. I mean, I'm really trying to get angry. <laughs> I never said it would be easy. It's really just a matter of increasing your energy and exploding with rage. Sounds simple, but to actually pull it off, you're gonna need more training. Right. I won't give up. Oh, yeah. My mom wanted to know if you'd have dinner with us tonight. You'll come, right? Uh, dinner? Uh, you sure it's okay? Yeah. I think she's already making enough for all of us. I see. Well, if that's the case, then I guess I'll head over. Awesome! Okay, let's get going. Is his appetite as bad as Cuckoo's? Three levels. Red Ribbon Army drones are on patrol. Oh, I sure hope they don't find anybody hiding from them. Hmm, I have to go. My mom's gonna be so happy. I can't remember the last time I had a meal with Bulma. So, you've known my mom for a long time, haven't you? Yeah. I was only four when I first met her. Actually, a lot happened that day. My life hasn't been the same since. Oh yeah? What happened? Well, it's complicated, but my dad's long lost brother kind of showed up and kidnapped me. Then I had to basically survive on my own in the wilderness for half a year. What, really? You mean that all happened when you were four years old? <laughs> Sounds unbelievable, but it's true. It's so incredible. I don't really know what to say. A drone. Better watch out. It's just me and Mom living here. They look simple enough to beat. I'm back, Mom! And I brought Gohan with me! Glad you're back safe, Trunks. And it's good to see you, Gohan. Yeah, good to see you too. Your timing's impeccable. I just finished preparing dinner. The androids have made it pretty hard to get everything I want. Some ingredients are hard to find. But I try to make up for it with my ability to adapt in the kitchen. I really appreciate this, Bulma. Food. And so, thanks to Bulma's efforts, the three were able to enjoy a nice meal together and relax. Hmm, thanks a lot for the meal. It was delicious. Whoa, you sure can't eat a lot, Gohan. Oh, uh, well, it was just so good I couldn't help myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you just like him. Huh? Like who? Seeing you in that outfit, eating like you do. 
You remind me so much of your father. It's almost like he's still here. I wear this as a way to remind myself that I need to be strong, just like him. My dad was a really carefree person. He never let anything get to him, even my mom chewing him out. That's so true. But that didn't stop him from risking his life time and time again to protect me and all the people he knew and loved. He was amazing. I want to carry on his legacy and fight for those I care about, for everyone. But I feel there's more I should be doing. Wow, Gohan's amazing. He's such a strong person. You're doing plenty. <laughs> Rumor has it you're out there giving the androids a hard time all on your own. <sighs> I'm impressed. <laughs> Thanks. Trunks is impressed too, and unfortunately, now he thinks this is his fight as well. Go on, tell him. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know, right? That I'm training to fight the androids? Again? <sighs> she knows. You know, it's already pretty late. You must be tired, Gohan. Why don't you just stay the night? Yeah, you should sleep over. Come on, stay, Gohan. Well, I, I am pretty tired. I'll take you up on that offer then. Good. I'll prepare a bed for you. Now, you two go clean yourselves up. You both smell like you've been working out together all day. Mm. Sorry about that. Oh, this cooking has been unlocked. <laughs> okay, so it's, it's the Belma uh, Chi Chi variant. Neat. Several days later, Trunks and Gohan take a short break after their training. Man, I was freaking out the other day at dinner. I thought my mom figured out we're training together. Well, Trunks, Bulma's one of the smartest people I know. If we keep staying out late, she'll eventually figure out what's going on. Yeah. So what should we do? Well, for starters, we shouldn't train every day. It might be best to incorporate some rest days into our routine. It'll be good for our bodies and prevent Bulma from worrying. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's do it. Now that I think about it, it'll help me out too, since I'm probably worrying my own mom and grandpa. <laughs> oh yeah, I've been wondering about Chi-Chi and the Ox King. Uh, have you seen them recently? How are they doing? Actually, you know, I haven't been back home since I started fighting the androids on my own. So, uh, I'm not really sure. Oh, okay. Every time I'd come back beaten up and broken from a fight with the androids, my mom would go crazy on me. She'd yell at me and tell me not to fight them. But I can't stop fighting. I have to avenge everyone the androids killed. And I have to protect this planet. That's what Dad would have done. Go on. But honestly, I am worried about how my mom and grandpa are doing. <laughs> Look at me. I guess I'm just as much a worrier as my mom. <laughs> anyway, enough about me and my family. Let's call it a day, all right? Okay. See you later. Maybe I should go check on Chi Chi and the Ox King for Gohan. Top story is Time no, we don't do those. Place. Okay. Noise. Him? A lot of noise came over there, but go check it out. Need to hurry. But I'm pretty sure. These robots. Huh? What's all that noise? What is that? Something's attacking Chi-Chi. Not good. I need to help her. 
Get back, you mechanical meanies! Leave me alone! Chi-Chi, watch out! Trunks, is that you? Yeah, what's with these robots? I'm not sure. They came out of nowhere and started attacking me! Okay, leave this to me. You go find a safe place to hide. No, I can't leave you to fight these things! I'll be fine. Don't worry, I'm a lot stronger than I look. Looks like these things are anything that moves. Alright, bring it on! Here I come! You're nothing compared to the androids. Take that! Take that, Oh, they follow me. Take that, Mercedes! It's on now! Try this on! That's all of them. I hope Chi Chi's okay. Chi Chi, are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Although I totally could have handled those buckets of bolts on my own. <laughs> Glad to see you're still full of energy. Yeah, I might not look like it, but I've still got some fight left in me. I am glad you showed up. Thanks, Trunks. It was no problem. What were you up to? Me? No, oh, I was just on my way back from checking on the fields. Cool. I'll escort you back to your house then, just in case any more of those robots show up. Really? Well then, escort away, Mr. Bodyguard. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Hey, Trunks, my boy. I really appreciate you saving Chi-Chi. You know, you'd make Vegeta proud. Oh, it was nothing. Nothing? No need to be so modest, Trunks. You fought just like my Gohan when he was little. Uh, really? Oh, uh, that reminds me. I heard you were out there helping Gohan fight those awful androids. You did? Not good, not good. How did he hear about that? If he knows, then my mom might find out. Uh, <laughs> well, you shouldn't believe everything you hear, you know. Oh, uh, so you're not? Well, uh, I guess that's good. Right. Those androids are way too dangerous for a kid like you to fight. I don't even like Gohan fighting them. He was going to be a world-class scholar when he got older. I know how you feel, Chi-Chi. But Gohan's made up his mind. He's our boy, and we should trust him. We just have to hope he stays safe. Gohan doesn't fight because he wants to but because he has to, and he's still thinking and worrying about you. Uh, at least that's what I think. You're right. Anyway, if you see him, would you please tell him to keep fighting, but to try to come home, like, every once in a while? I will. Okay, well, I'd better head back now. Stay safe, you two. Thanks. Give my regards to Bulma, okay? Have a safe trip back home. Thanks. Oh, uh, could you maybe not tell my mom what you heard about me helping Gohan fight the androids? <laughs> It'll just stress her out. <laughs> of course. Stuff. No. I should let Gohan know how Chi Chi and the Ox King are doing. I wonder if Gohan's where we were before. I knew 
Indeed should you be worried about Gohan. I need to make sure my mom doesn't find out what I'm up to. They look simple enough to beat. Ah! Gohan! Oh, hey Trunks. I thought you went back home for the rest of the day. Actually, I was just visiting your mom and grandpa at their place. Oh, really? Why would you do that? You said you were worried, so I went and checked on them. There was a small issue, but they're okay. Small issue? Yeah, some weird machines were attacking your mom, but I took care of them. Really? Oh no, is my mom okay? Yeah, not a scratch on her. That's a relief. Thanks a lot, Trunks. Seriously, if you hadn't been there, there's no telling what might have happened. Um, Chi Chi wanted me to tell you something. She said keep fighting, but try to make it home once in a while. Oh, uh, I can't go right now, obviously, but I guess I'd better start making regular trips back to make sure she's doing okay. She'd like that. Right. Speaking of family, you'd better head back yourself before Bulma starts worrying. Controller is still connected. True. See you later. If I really want to put everyone at ease, I need to defeat the androids and bring peace back to this world. The area around West City suffered numerous casualties today as the androids continued their rampage. Residents in nearby areas have been ordered to evacuate immediately. <sighs> um, Chi Chi wanted me to tell you something. She said keep fighting, but try to make it home once in a while. Mom, just hang on a bit longer. I promise I'll come back once the androids are gone. The next day, Trunks and Gohan continue their training with a new resolve. Right. Let's begin the training. What are we gonna do today? Another sparring match? We can, and will do that. But I think we need to focus on making you a Super Saiyan. So, let's start there. I'm sorry this isn't going well. I don't think I can become a Super Saiyan today. It's not supposed to be easy. Don't worry. We'll take our time with it. Okay. That explosion. It has to be the androids. I cannot let them destroy another town. Then let's go, Gohan. No. Trunks still can't transform into a Super Saiyan. He's not ready for this fight yet. I'll be back. You stay here. Wait, Gohan. I can go with you and help you fight. You're still not ready to take them on. Just stay here for now. But, like, any help would be better than nothing. Right, Gohan? Not if you die. Fine. But try to keep up, okay? And don't push it if you think it's too much. Thanks. Information. Yes. Let's go. If we don't hurry, people are gonna die. Right. Those androids are going to pay. If there was only some way of knowing where they are. Hard to do that when we can't detect their energy. We're gonna have to hunt them down the hard way. Why are the androids doing this? Why are they killing? Oh, there they are. <laughs> That's enough, androids. How could you monsters do this? Oh, great. You guys again. What a drag. Let's get rid of them so we can keep having some fun. There are tons of other far more interesting people left to kill. I'm not gonna let you do that. Go on. Let me help you fight them. Fine. 
You can be my support, but try not to put yourself directly in harm's way. Uh, okay. I'm more than enough to handle these losers on my own. Try to make it snappy, okay? We've got places to be. One slip up and we're done for. You need to be careful, Trunks. Right. Here I go! Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see you try to run away from ah. here. Goes right through, guys. a little more like it. Hello. Welcome Good to the stream. Way. We're winning, Gohan. Not yet. There's still a long way to go before they're done. Ah! Trunks! Hmm. You thought you were winning? Give me a break. It's lights out for you guys. Well, would you look at that? At least they're good at running away. They're pretty nimble for a couple of meat bags. you're hiding we'll find you so you think we got him 18 yeah they're dead but even if they are alive we'll find them come on 17 let's get out of here hmm. okay sure
It's all right, let's go, hon. This is my last sensu bean trunks. You take it. You're our last hope, trunks. This is not how he dies. I hope this is not how they are portraying it. Uh, uh, the androids! They're... Gone? No! Go on! Your arm. Go on! Go on! Are they cutting corners again? Uh, oh, he's left. You're still breathing. You're gonna be okay. We need to get you home. This is bad. The androids were too strong. I'm only getting in Gohan's way. At least he knows. Level up. Several days later, though Gohan had lost an arm, he was spared the same fate as the others. After a miraculous recovery, he had regained the strength and determination needed to fight once more. With one less arm. Trunks, on the other hand, felt responsible for Gohan's injury and struggled to find the courage to face his mentor. Oh, you seem out of it, Trunks. It, yeah. I know you were trying to keep it a secret from me, but... I know all about your training sessions with Gohan. I'm sorry, Mom. You used to head over to Gohan's place to train, right? You haven't been there in a while. It, it's because of me that Gohan... that he... How am I supposed to face him? It wasn't your fault, Trunks. I know that. And more importantly, I'm sure Gohan knows that. You'll feel a lot better if you just go see him and, and tell him how you're feeling. Trust me. I guess you're right. I'll head over there now. Good. Be careful, okay? I have no idea what I'm gonna say when I see Gohan. I'm sure Gohan's feeling better and can move around and stuff. But he probably can't do much training anymore. I bet his arm would be a lot better if he'd been able to eat a sensor. They look simple enough to beat. Good, you're here. Let's get started with... Huh? What's with the long face? Go on. Y your arm. Uh, are you okay? Yeah. It's gonna take some getting used to, though. Oh, I get it. So that's why you seem so upset, Trunks. I'm really sorry. Don't worry about it, man. It's in the past, so no use thinking about it now. Besides, I'm just grateful I only lost an arm. But... Okay. If your head's not completely in this, then this is no time to be training. No, I can still train with you. Relax. It's okay. Sometimes a warrior has to refocus. You know what? I've got an idea. What do you say we go catch us some fish? Sound good? Ish. Uh, okay. You want to go fishing? Where exactly? Huh. Let's see. There's an island near West City with a lighthouse on it. That ought to be a good spot. Oh, right. Come to think of it, I don't think I've ever gone fishing with anyone before. Oh. That makes sense. Vegeta wasn't around when you were old enough to start. Yeah. 
Did my father fish? Not sure. I've never seen him do it. Honestly, I can't really picture him sitting patiently waiting for a bite. <laughs> oh, yeah, good point. He fished on Emic. When I was a kid, my dad showed me how to fish. You know how to fish, Trunks? Yeah, I think so. While we're here, how about a little competition? The one who catches the most fish wins. I swear, if you pull out a what? mechanical tail. No huh? Wait a sec. I definitely can't beat you in a fight, but I think I might actually be able to beat you in a fishing competition. <laughs> Good. Then that settles it. Don't let me down, Trunks. I'm ready for you. I'm not gonna lose. Let's see. Where should I fish first? When arm fishing, interesting. Seems Gohan's already looking for a spot. All right, all right. I'll fish. I count this as filler. Bite. Does that count as two? Oh, man. This looks like a keeper. And that's all the fish. All right, I did it. I wonder how Gohan's doing. You didn't use a fishing rod, wow, did you? You caught a lot, Gohan. Let's count them up. Huh. I think you caught more. All right, I beat you. I beat you. Way to go, Trunks. You might be a better fisherman than my dad. So, what should we do with all the fish? I don't know about you, but I'm pretty hungry. Let's cook them. What is this? Whew. I, I think I ate too much. <laughs> <laughs> we did fish up a lot, didn't we? Yeah, we sure did. <sighs> Is something wrong? No. Just glad to see you're back to your old self. Oh. Thanks. You went out of your way to make me feel better. Sorry if I worried you. I didn't go out of my way at all. Think of this as just another part of your training. Uh-huh. You mean catching fish and eating them? Totally. It's part of the turtle school teachings. The ones my dad learned from Master Roshi. According to him, you should be moving, learning, playing, eating, and resting every day. He'd always say that enjoying life is part of one's training, too. Oh, okay. That sounds like good advice. Training you makes me nostalgic. It takes me back to a time when Piccolo trained me when I was a kid. Back then, though, I thought I was training with a monster. He was so ruthless. Seriously, it, it felt like a year and a half of pure torture. <laughs> Actually, if I remember correctly, I was training to help save Earth from Vegeta and the other Saiyan jerk Nappa that came with him. Seriously? Y you had to go through all of that because of my father? I'm so sorry. <laughs> you know, it is pretty strange to think I'm training the son of a guy who once tried to destroy the planet. A long time before he trained me, Piccolo supposedly fought my dad as his mortal enemy. Weird how fate works, isn't it? Yeah, it brings people together, like us. Exactly. And all of those people, my dad, yours, and everyone else, they live on in you now, Trunks. Go on. That's why it's so important that you stay alive. 
and I'll keep training you to make sure you stay that way. If anyone's gonna bring peace, it's you. You're our last hope. Don't worry. You'll surpass me in no time. I, I promise I won't let you down. Good. We'll get stronger together. And we'll make sure our world is safe again. Right, Chunks? Right! Piccolo sacrificed himself to protect me back then. I was too young to understand. But now I know what he felt in that moment. You're the last warrior alive who can do this, Trunks. It's all up to you. I'm afraid you're our last hope. The people of this world are going to count on you to protect them when the time comes. But I believe in you with all of my heart. You can do this, Trunks. A few days later, Trunks and Gohan's training reaches a fever pitch. Get angry. Angrier. Why can't I turn into a Super Saiyan? You're almost there, Trunks. It's not easy. My dad and I struggle to become Super Saiyans, too. It's like I said before. Rage triggers the transformation. True rage. Thinking about Piccolo, Krillin, and everyone else dying, I was devastated with grief. It upset me so much that I was overcome with anger. And it was then that I became a Super Saiyan. You've got Vegeta's Royal Saiyan blood coursing through your veins. You're going to become a Super Saiyan. I know it. Believe in yourself. If you say so. All right. That's enough Super Saiyan training for now. Let's spar. Okay, let's do it. We're fighting. Fighting the one arm go high. Me with all you got. Right. Here I come. If you can't fight me while I'm at a disadvantage, then you've got no hope of beating the androids. I know. You're holding back on me, aren't you? No, I'm not. I swear. I'm not that injured. Why would you? Right. Take this. If you really get then poof, go all out. Okay, good. Now. Punish your opponent when your guard is down. I'm gonna pull my punches just because he's injured. But you're getting better. I have to be better than you. Better than the androids. It's on now. Don't you fall for it. Is this your best? Your defense needs a lot of work. Try this on. Was great. Thank you. It's fun. I mean, the beginning of the game before you enter, like the Boo Saga, is filled with filler. You're a lot stronger than you were before. But it's still fun. Yeah. If only I could become a Super Saiyan, though. You will. You just need something to help trigger the transformation. It's the androids. They finally found their way here. This is it. Go on. Are you sure you're okay? I'm worried. I might not be able to keep Trunks safe this time. 
Trunks, stay here, got it? Do not follow me. No, if you're going, then I'm going too. You said it yourself. Mm -hmm. I'm a lot stronger now. Trunks, you're underestimating how hard this fight will be. Nah, I just wasn't talking. I promise I won't drag you down. I, I want to help you fight them. I tend to not try and talk over them. I get it. Fine, Trunks. Let's go. Okay. Trunks, you're humanity's last hope. If both of us die, then there won't be a single warrior left to protect the planet. As the only one left who's capable of ending this nightmare in a few years' time, you have to survive. Is it dry water? Emblem. I'm sorry, Trunks. I might not be able to stop the androids, but if you were around, they'd be distracted. As long as I know you're alive and safe, I can give it my all. And if I do fail, you'll have what it takes to finish the job. There. Ah! Give it a rest, Luigi 17. We've already killed almost everyone here. We should head somewhere where tons and tons of people are hiding. It would be way more. Why are you in such a rush? Let's just try to enjoy ourselves. If we wipe out all of humanity now, then the fun ends and we've got nothing left to do, right? That'd be cool. So, Gohan, back for more, huh? No more running away. We're gonna kill you this time. I won't die. Even if you destroy my body. I'll live on in someone who'll become stronger than me. And he will be the one to stop you once and for all. Let's do this. Yeah, it's only Hey, no need to get so worked up, though. Of course, we'll make this clear. Yeah, we've grown tired of playing with you. Here I go! You humans sure do go down in easy. Where's our macho hero attitude gone? Ready to call it quits? Get out of here! I've heard her bow. Still undecided if I'm gonna play Wukong yet. Let's see. 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 Let's see.
Am I supposed to die here? I have some of these. The other one's causing the issue. What a pain in the ass. Say goodbye. Now for the second. Where's the little rat you brought last time? It's none of your business, jerk. Here I go. Masenko. Masenko. I will avoid you. Masenko. Masenko. I will avoid you. Masenko. Masenko. Let's try that again. I wanted it hard, so I got it hard. Hey, no need to get so worked up. Don't worry, we'll make this quick. Yeah, we've grown tired of playing with you. Here I go! Here I go! 
all the macho hero attitude gone. Not die. Where's the little runt you brought last time? It's none of your business, jerk. We'll find you. This world of you too. Try to run away from it. No. Get out of here. Here it comes. Get out of here. No, oh, boy. They're just in that form. destroyed my health all at once. Okay, I need some more items. What am I loading? Ugh. Time to skip some stuff. And become the man you're meant to be. You got this, Trunks. Skip the movie. That's what we got. Hello! Hey, no need to get so worked up, go yeah, we've grown tired of playing with you. Those humans sure do go down easy. What a pain I was hoping we could have at least a little more fun with you. Nope. 
Good lord. Now you're stunned. Still stunned. You get out of here. Down one. What choice do I have? You're not even letting me get items. You go away. They go again. It's a dodge fest. This is doable. Step, but... Ah! Ah! <laughs> 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 That's fun. Choice. I couldn't buy any more items. Uh, 
Whoops. Psych. <laughs> The rain! I feel awful for having to disappoint you like this, but we've only been fighting at half our full power. <laughs> You're not going anywhere, Gohan. <laughs> hey, what? I don't know. What? Oh, let, let's talk about this. Oh. Okay, so now you just did oh, nothing. On. You've got to have more in you than that. You gotta give up or what? You should. Come on, Gohan. I'd hate you to go out like this. No energy. So. Bring it on, Oliver. You said you were gonna defeat us, right? Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. So, uh, there's no healing from this. Now you just made it impossible, game. <laughs> this is all I can right, do. I think it's time you finally die. Huh. This is your last chance to stand up. Come on, go on. If you even can. Why did it push me forward? I didn't do that. I think life. it's time to put him out of his misery. I was supposed to die from that, wasn't I? <laughs> hmm. Okay. Show's over, I guess. Imagine a what if of this. Okay. Yeah, androids have infinite energy, man. That was a bad choice. Look at that, infinite energy at work. Oh, God. Energy. Go on. Welcome back, Sans. It's gonna make me fly there. Okay. Go on. You missed an intense Something's battle. Because right. the Are game didn't let me buy on. more things, so I had to brute force that shit. Uh, over here. Find Gohan. It's making me look. Then if he's, if he's dead, you won't be able to sense him no way. Ah, uh, showing him on the map. Where is he at? Where is he at? Swimming right here. Is that him? Tis okay. Tis okay. 
on. Go on. No, go on. Please, no. This can't be real. Go on. Go on. Go on. How did I get an S from that last battle? Wait, hold on. I like it. No, yep. Stuff. Wait, I had more stuff all along. Trunks had finally become a Super Saiyan. However, the transformation came at a great cost. <laughs> 